Hello, in this video I'll show you how to make a circle lock pattern. This is a nice design to add to any blank surface or canvas and it's pretty easy to make. I tried it out on this blank canvas just to show that you can make a nice piece of art out of a simple pattern that you can make by hand. If you're new to my channel, I make a lot of how to draw and DIY pattern videos and you can check them all out in this playlist right here. I'm also open to suggestions, so if there's something you want to learn how to make, leave a comment below and that playlist will get updated regularly. For this circle lock pattern, here are a couple of different ways you can make it. First, I'll show you the basics of the pattern. All you need is a tool to make circles with or something round to trace. In my case, I'm using a tape roll or you can use a bowl. First, make rows of circles that are lined up right next to each other and just continue this until you have a full page. Then make circles on the diamond shaped parts of the pattern and continue making rows of circles just like you did before, all lined up and centered evenly. And you'll see all the circles get divided into these four geometric shapes. And then you have a continuous circle lock pattern. Another way to make the pattern is to stamp with something round, and in this case, I'm using a toilet paper roll. Dab the end in some paint and do the same method that you just learned, making rows and rows of circles right next to each other, all aligned. And continue with the next step, centering the circle on the diamond shape and just continue that row by row. And if you want this to be off the page and look continuous, just do a half circle on the edge. This handmade stamp has a rough texture and I actually don't mind that, I think it looks kind of cool. It just goes to show you can make this pattern with different techniques and have unique results. For this next design, I did the same thing I showed you in the beginning, but this time I'm tracing a bowl, which is a little larger, and just continue making circles on this piece of wood. Then to the middle sections, and continue that on to the edge. Now I have my canvas full of a circle lock pattern, and for this one I used acrylic paint to fill in the four divided shapes. You can really fill in any of the divided shapes to make a cool combination of the circles. I filled in these leaf type shapes with four different colors, just tracing along the pencil lines that I made as a guide. After the paint is dry, depending on the piece of art you're making, you can then erase the pencil lines. The final result is a fun combination of this pattern, which makes a nice art piece that was simple to make. I hope you guys found this tutorial helpful and it gives you some inspiration for circle lock patterns you can make on your next project. For more videos, be sure to subscribe to my channel, Sea Lemon. If you like butterflies, check out this tutorial to the left for another piece of art you can make by hand. And if you want to see a more vlog side to Sea Lemon, check out the video to the right where I go over some of my favorite things, which I call lemon likes. You can find all these links and more in the description below and let me know what you would like to make next. Leave a comment and like this video if you liked it. I'll see you next time.